Hi everyone, it's Brett, sales manager at Virtuosity again. I want to talk to you about a really spectacular mouthpiece that just came out. Uh, Autolink and JJ Babbitt have started re-releasing legacy mouthpieces. And the one I'm going to talk about today is the Autolink Connoisseur Early Babbitt Tenor Mouthpiece. I've had a bunch of these, the original Early Babbitts, uh, and I'm really impressed at this moment because out of the box, these feel like mouthpieces that have been around and played and, and touched up for over 30 years uh, with the ability to be flexible, powerful, uh, warm, bright. Uh, it really is an all-in-one mouthpiece. A couple things that I really like about it that I'm, I'm recently getting hip to is the shape of the baffle, where it has a super thin tip, thin rails, super flat table, comes with a nice ligature, it's a two screw, kind of looks like the old summer ones. And with that, the, it just sort of lets my vintage horn speak too. Um, one thing I run into with mouthpiece a lot is that they don't work super well on my old Selmer, especially for intonation. This one fits beautifully, works beautifully, and lets me be as free and as open as I need to be on my horn. <laughs> I love this mouthpiece. I think it's a spectacular piece. I think Babbitt and Autolink are really swinging for the fences, especially if you're playing improvised music. Uh, it allows me the freedom to be loud. It, it can be bright, it can be dark, I can be as anyone as I want to be in that moment. It seems to be very uh, read friendly as well. I tested it out with four or five different reads before, and I, I think it's a really spectacular thing. So I really encourage anyone who, who wants an all around mouthpiece to come to Virtuosity, test play this. And then also if you're looking for other product videos and performances at Virtuosity, please check our social medias uh, on Facebook, Instagram, and then our live streams on Facebook, Twitch, and YouTube. Thank you. Uh, I need to be more concise. Okay. <laughs>